Now, a lot of a lot has been made of the weight loss. Mm. Uh, for English people, I think you lost something like three and a half stone, is what we would say. 47 pounds. What would that three be? and a half stone. Here we go. <laughs> three and a half stone. <laughs> three and a half stone. Yeah. It sounded, three and a half stone sounds yeah. heavy, doesn't it? Yeah. 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 Pounds. Mm. No. Uh, <laughs> three and a half stone. Uh, <laughs> does, does it kind of frustrate you in a way that that's got so much attention? Where you're kind of like still acting over here, <laughs> still doing really good acting. Yeah, I, I understood that you know before the film came out, that's your headline. That photo. Yeah. That came out of me in the airport. Um, was the wow? Oh, that's how we get people to click on this site. I got that. Yeah. Um, I'm happy to say and happy that the reaction has been that once people saw the film, yes, the weight loss was something. But I mean, you see, you know, who this guy was, and it wasn't. It wasn't. It be quickly became something more than the Matthew McConaughey got skinny film. If yes. you see the film, yeah. it's obvious in about 30 seconds that that's not the film you're in. No, but you needed to do it. Yeah, this was not an, uh, an affectation. This was not an eccentric idea I had about I think it'd be really cool if I lost a lot of weight. Yeah. You know, this was one of those ones where you go, it's my responsibility to do this, to best portray this man. If I do not, I will be embarrassed. And you're also not going to buy the But also, movie. your family and friends must have been... Were they, they must have been worried for you. Yeah, I mean, the people that know me, know me well, they, they, there were some people that got a little bit worried, but I said, I've got it. It was under control, and it was... I met with the nutritionist, did it as healthily as possible. And my family was around me daily. It was so gradual, they didn't really notice it. My, my daughter one day said, Papa, why is your neck like a giraffe? That was... <laughs> other than that. Well, what were you eating, honestly? Five ounces of fish, a couple of vegetables twice a day. Uh -huh. Some pudding in the morning and as much red wine as I liked at night. <laughs> but it was small amounts, and I gave myself four months to do it. So I just right. clocked off three and a half pounds a month, and it just worked like clockwork. Now, Julianne, you kind of had the opposite problem because both times you were pregnant, <laughs> you were in movies. Yeah, just getting bigger and bigger by the day. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And you're trying to hide that. That's a horrible thing, too. When you're in Big Lebowski, yeah. I was pregnant and didn't tell anybody and had to fly, you know, fly naked, throwing paint, and then come down at a, you know, and was nauseous the entire time. And then I was pregnant again when I played the old woman in the hour. So I was an 80 year old pregnant woman. <laughs> it was pretty inconvenient. Yeah. Really, really. So I wore a raincoat the whole time and kind of hunched over. And yeah, but it was, wardrobe now? Yeah, yeah, no, yes. By then, they, okay. of course they did. But if you can imagine all my old age makeup, my wig and everything, and then you look down, and I was like seven months pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> like, oh. what happened to Grandma? <laughs> no, weird, because Alan, didn't you have a weird weight thing? I did, I did. I got asked to go for an audition for a part, and I turned up and I met a guy in, the, in this kind of ante room outside who I knew, who's huge. He was a really <laughs> big actor. Said hi, and then hello. And then another guy came in who I half knew, and he was also enormous. And I looked around, and everyone was enormous. <laughs> <laughs> Quite cramped in the room. <laughs> <laughs> and there were some snacks. They'd all gone. <laughs> <laughs> I said, what part are you here for? And I can't remember what it was now, Roger or something. And I said, yeah, I'm here for Roger as well. And I, <laughs> and I went in, and there were three people, and they looked up, and they looked down, and they looked up again. And I said, have you lost some weight? <laughs> no, I've always been this shape. <laughs> oh, OK. Well, you may as well read it anyway. I said, really? Do you want me to read it or eat it? Shall I just eat it? <laughs> <laughs>